most, I forgot the word slander. Yeah, I swear, you was telling lies on somebody. That is bare, slander is bearing false witness. That's what it is. These things have thou done, and I kept silent. Thou, know, thou thoughtest that I was altogether such as one as thyself, but I reproved thee and set them in order before thine eyes. I consider this, ye that forget God, lest I tear you in pieces, and there be none to deliver. Whoso offereth praise glorifieth me, and to him that uh, ordereth his conversation aright, will I show the salvation of God. Well, that's a uh, two that's uh, James White, that's vocab alone, homie. So that means they ain't in agreement with that statement. I want to see Vocab Malone come out and uh, disavow. You know how they made Trump disavow uh, David Duke? I want to. I want to see uh, Vocab disavow James White. You know what I mean? He, you know, now he down with the KKK now and shit. Now he got Vocab affiliated with the KKK. That's <laughs> <laughs> some crazy shit. Now, man, them dudes ain't looking too good. First Shield Squad got broken up. Now they out here just bold racist. Well, I had a the spirit. Oh man, I lost, lost my spirit. Go ahead. Exodus twenty-three and one. Thou shalt not rise a false report. Yep. Put not thy hand with the wicked to be unrighteous witness. Right. They say Israelites were worse than the KKK. K, where's your proof? Who have they killed? Who have Israelites killed? What? What? What did they? They know they, they damaged no property. They ain't hurt no person. They never robbed nobody. Never lynched nobody. Never hung nobody. Maybe it's getting reference to the Hebrew. Cut his ass up. He getting an ass over spiritually, spiritually now. I give you on that one. Y'all has got cut up, chopped up, beat down, lynched, drug down the street. You know what I mean? But brought back to life and did it yeah, all you know, over. Yeah, hung his ass <laughs> off the top of a building, dropped him. Did a Macho Man elbow drop on him. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> they get fucked up spiritually. No, See, that's what happens when you get your ass beat spiritually. You get that fatigue. You start saying crazy shit. You're desperate. You get desperate. That's like, yeah, desperate. You don't realize what you're saying. That we know you all desperate and proud, bro. You, you don't know what you're saying. If that tells you true. If you can't even control your own speech, that tells you the spirit's not with you. If the spirit was with you, you won't be saying no wild shit like that. That's crazy. You got the black conscious community coming up against James White and supporting the Eagles. Are they? That's when we really made that video. Oh, for real? Yeah. Oh, man. That's beautiful. So yeah, it's over for James White. Now he might get ostracized by his own Christian people. His own Christian people might be. Oh, you probably like uh, James White, the racist. The Edomite. They look like, man, James White might be an Edomite. You know? <laughs> James White, he is a goofy looking guy, man. He's all, he's all squirrely looking. He looks like a, a I can't think of the word. Oh, he got that goofy ass smile and them bug eyes. He look like uh, the dude from uh, GOCC White Cousin or something. They go, they, they look like they make a good uh, uh, friendship. James White and the dude from GOCC. <laughs> they be singing, hey, they can see you picture them singing together. You know? They go, <laughs> hey, you see dude from GOCC sing? Nah, bro, he sing like some of a little mermaid. He got the Disney vocals. Hey. He comes out with part of this world. Yeah, oh, that nigga still singing. Man, he was saying, I heard him singing. He can actually sing good, but it's like it's a kid. It's, right? it's like Disney. I'm telling you, you know, like the last yeah. the last song on the movie, it's the happy. Like, <laughs> like a happy day. They can sing like churches too. Like, yeah, I'll be thinking like. I think <laughs> your boy Sebastian is gonna start singing like, or what's the Aladdin or something? I'm hearing him sing. I don't know what the fuck you think about him. And the way he was moving his, this is just too much. I think, yeah, I think I've seen it. Yeah, That's too much. I think I've seen it. Well, it, it was, I mean, he could sing. I mean, he could hit the hit the notes and everything. Yeah, you know that's not yeah. That's not yeah, my yeah. kind of music though. You know. I used to have a bass and drums. Oh, and and then. That's another thing too. Like everybody that teach the uh, all these Israelite groups, Christians, whatever, all y'all to put out music is all trash. Yeah. Vocab, your music is trash. What's that one dude? He put out Jada producer. Yeah. Oh, what's that trash. nigga? Trash. That, that chemistry camp shit like twice. Trash. 
Trash. Oh, you guys, they cut it. They took a song about. Oh, yeah, yeah, I heard that. They took a song about. They took a song about dope. It was in a. And put scriptures in it. Talk about you guys, they cut it. How you gonna take cutting dope? Big ass store. Remember, it was behind the. It was behind the. The pizza store. Remember that shit? That shit was goofy. It was off the front of the five dollar pizza. Now they was like, dude, you know, uh, uh, was I there? Oh, the nigga, he was talking, he's reading scriptures. Main nigga, what's the was name? Was I there? Nah, nah, we watched the video. Nah, the video. Right. Oh, we was watching the video. Yeah. The nigga, Paraz, he's, he's out there t-shirt. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah I know, yeah. yeah. That's the we got next to all this. Well, I think we're gonna get it. Yeah, Zabak. Yeah. I give Zabak I credit a little bit. He go, he go harder than uh, uh, IUIC. I'll tell you, I give him that much. Because... I think he might be a little sincere with this shit, man. Are you I see you can tell they're not sincere. Yeah, they, they, you can tell they're not. Yeah. You can tell. Yeah. They, you can tell they got an agenda. Yeah, it's, I mean, yeah. It's like they set up by the fucking feds. I mean, straight up. Hey, they just set up by the feds. But a lot of people don't know, like, a lot of these churches. Yeah, I think so. Yeah, if you want BET, you know you don't sold out. Right. I don't know they own it yet, but... You got, you know, they, they, like I said, they probably part of the fraternities and all that. News, what it is. Hey, cause, you know, uh, infiltrate. Well, yeah. these churches that are under the 501c3, they do have an agent in there, actually, part of the church. So, uh, let's say, what, 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 why would you think IUIC would be any different not have an agent amongst them? They have to, they would have right, to. Right, right. Remember the time we was at the church down the street, right? Remember the dude went to his car? Yeah, he, he did. Talked, yeah, yeah. You know? Yeah, up at the Judah Tabernacle. He went to his truck. You remember? Reason. He's like, you told us to come on now. <laughs> yeah, but I ain't never been on that because they got these uh, these uh, what they call it? They got they got these uh, fuck, I can't. My brain is not working right. These deep, what they call it? The deep state now. They got these deep state operations. These uh, these psychological mind control programs. Ooh. Where they take, they got actual CIA operatives. This sounds crazy, right, no, but sound but crazy. they take they take these operatives and they put them in the churches. So a lot of times, a pastor. I'm not saying all of them, because you got a lot of. Actually, I'll say this: a lot of pastors might actually be sincere about what they're doing and actually be trying to help people, but they just be ignorant of the truth. But you got a, some pastors though, be actual CIA agents, be actual feds planted in these buildings to keep tabs on everybody, to to, to look, you know. To keep, Records on you, spy on you, to teach bullshit. It's all, it's all the, you know, the manip design. Manip to keep their order. Yeah, to keep their order. To keep their order. Because, the real order. because the whole spiritual and religion thing, the devil knows how. What does the word CIA mean? Central intelligence. Intelligence. They're very intelligent, and they know how you know people's thoughts and stuff are moved and controlled by a spiritual thing. You know, like you know what I mean. So they go on because the, cause the church control a big part of the way this country thinks or the whole world thinks. It's like uh, during slavery they would have the, the cracker ass cracker in the back of this in the, uh, in the uh, back of the church in Washington. Uh, yeah. They, they set up, they, they Make sure you don't get out of right. They go have operatives in these churches. Make sure they don't get you can't so they can't teach about uh the market. Yeah rebel well they don't definitely don't want you to be rebellious. They gonna teach they uh, if you get caught teaching about the market of the beast being a microchip they're gonna report you. If you get caught teaching out against uh, uh, homosexuality, you'll get reported. Hell, twelve trials against me. Yeah, oh, you definitely. Yeah, you gone. You done. You fired. I got two scriptures. <laughs> two scriptures in the pump. Oh, yeah. you get all the scriptures. But uh, um, also like when the shit is the fan, when the shit is the fan, they they gonna have to control the information. You know what I'm saying? I forgot what the term is called. But like when the shit is the fan, they gotta control the information. Like you can't say certain shit because that's gonna rough. That's gonna rile people up. They're gonna have a media blackout. You know what I'm saying? You're not, you're not gonna be able to go on this channel. Only they're gonna listen to is Oh, channel. they already got that because YouTube got the new policy. Did you got it? You know how you gotta agree to the terms of terms? Uh, sir, I can't uh, speak. Man, I give up. I give up on language. You gotta agree to the terms of service, and it's it, it part of the new terms of service. And you can't be putting up no conspiracy videos about school shootings and all that. They gonna start deleting your shit. 
I got two strikes on my channel. Brother said his channel was he was blocked out of his channel. Yeah. They starting to fuck with us on the, on our YouTube channels. Or they just, they they watch the real fucking thing. This movie C said they don't want everybody who talk bad at government against the government or all their names or whatever. And remember there was that little the scene. Yeah. They were trying to find out that there was like a hell of terrorist attack shit. Yeah. So that's gonna happen. What movie is that? See. Yeah, you seen some shit. Yeah, old school. What Denzel? Denzel. I'm out of here. With um, Bruce Willis, was, he was a captain of the was a captain of the Marines. That uh, helped bring in martial law. Oh yeah, was that Bruce Willis? That's a badass movie. Bruce Willis. Okay, yeah, he wasn't really a main character in it. Though, oh yeah. He made a, a few here and there appearances in it. But, uh, yeah, I remember that. Yeah. I just, I'm rusty on that. Yeah, she's a badass movie. Yeah, that, that's real shit right there. Martial law and all that. Shit might be heavy, man. That's what these people don't do. Shit is a lot too big. You got to do it. Heavy. Each day. I can't wait, man. I'm tired of this shit. I'm tired of going to work. I'm tired of fucking dealing with these, looking at these assholes. I'm tired of the Easter. I'm tired of Christmas. I'm tired of all this little faggot shit they got going on. Yeah, I'm definitely tired of bills, taxes. What's well, that old shit? De well, how's the old saying go? Deaths and taxes or whatever. Yeah, it's all these motherfuckers. Everything costs money in this bitch, man. You can't, you literally can't take a shit without paying. You gotta pay them plus to it. Goddamn. You gotta pay to wipe your ass. Isaiah 29 talking about the family of the word. Isaiah 29. It says that make a man an offender for a word and lay a snare for him that reprove him from the gate. You know what they, that's what they do? They, they try to, uh, what are we doing? We're proving from the gate. What are we doing right now? Y'all the ways wrong. Pretty much Esau. That's what uh, Wisdom of Solomon 2 says that Esau looked at us and they said they ate the gate. Remember that? Somebody get in, please. It's like a little long, but it pretty much, son, it's pretty much showing you how Esau hates us, hates him, look at us because we're contrary to what he's doing. We're saying what he's doing wrong, so they said, so let's get together and see if that God is true or not. But uh, going back to this verse, it says, uh, Isaiah 29 and uh, 21. Now make a man offender yeah, for a word and lay a snare for him that reproves in the gate and has turned aside the just for a thing of naught. They're going to do it. Eventually, they'll come. You know, try to get some sort of see. It's great. It's great. It's great. Let them make their move, man. Once they make their move, that's when the most high gonna make his move. I got it. I got it. I like to read sometimes too, man. Behold, Job, right to the seventh. Job, right to the seventh. Behold, I cry out of wrong, but I am not heard. I cry aloud, but there is no judgment. Cry aloud. There ain't no judgment out here. Joe yeah, that's, the, that's the problem with this world. Shit, there's no judgment out here. Mm. Hey, well, hey, that's true though. We cry out, but we still no judgment though, is it? See, we be out here crying. There's still no judgment. We out here crying. We've been teaching out here in Columbus. Man, since, yeah. since Obama. Yeah, since, since Obama first got it up in there. As soon as he got inaugurated. Actually, we came in this thing with Obama. Right. You know what I mean, right? You know what I mean? Yeah. When Obama came into office, we came into office. I like, was on vacation. Yeah, he, 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 he fell off. We yeah. <laughs> going harder than Obama. He was our opposite. Yeah. I remember the first time we we went teaching down here. Yeah. When we was getting on Obama as soon as he got elected. We told people on day one. Oh, going to find Bill we, we was like, oh, he way worse than Bush. Y'all yeah. ain't ready. But we was like, he going to find all of a sudden watch him. We didn't want to find Bill Ladd. I remember. I, <laughs> and he I, found Bill Ladd. I remember the first day when we was talking about Obama. <laughs> People was looking at us like we was crazy. Right. And they thought the state that the uh thought y'all was shy. Yeah. <laughs> they thought he was the chosen one. <laughs> like was the basement. Well that's how even Farrakhan first said he was the chosen one. But then eight years later Farrakhan's like, oh he got to go. Oh, that's how Jay he confused. First Farrakhan was like, Obama is uh, the chosen one. What did he say? And then, then, then he said he was like, well, he's fucking blunt or something. I don't know who the fuck that is. Who is he hollering at us or something? Uh, so, so, so. I don't know, I guess. <laughs> Man, yeah, you got to start. 
That's the thing. We come out here and teach everybody know you. Yeah. You know what I mean? It's a small world too, so. They still ain't learning shit. That's the thing. They ain't learning a goddamn thing. Yeah. What? Oh, you put a lot on the line by coming out here teaching them. Yeah. You see people you know, they, they might make fun of you, crack jokes on you. You know what I mean? Go talk shit about you to your family, to your girl, to your job, to your wife. Yeah. Get you fired from your job. What'd you say? 25 He that fear the Lord believed in him. Oh, we can talk. Hey, let me read this one. Let's read this one. I cleanse it from my phone. Why oh, the spirit just made me go here, though? That's the spirit, see? Now, he wanted to take the ass. Let's take it. I'm like, you can't just be nice, bro. Nice. I'm telling you. I'm going to fix her up. You know what I mean? Put some new parts in there. Hey, look at this scripture, but that was a great book. Uh, Ecclesiasticus uh, 2 and 8. Ye that fear the Lord, believe him in your reward. And I, I messed that up. Ye that fear the Lord, believe him, and your reward shall not fail. I thought you thought that was Your reward shall not fail. We're going to get rewarded for doing this. Like I said, we come out here teaching. You put a lot on the line, but I come out here teaching. I mean, I, we don't even care, though. But... You know, to the average person in the world, they not the average person ain't gonna want to do this and go, be at risk of losing their job or a woman leaving them or losing friends over this thing. Most people ain't gonna do that, you know. But that's why we we try, we try to get that reward. We're the eyeball. Yeah, yeah, we're eyeballs. We eyeballs. We the outcasts. <laughs> we are really are the outcasts of society. They look at us like we the dregs. Well, really, they the dregs. Right. They, they the at... down ones, for real. <laughs> he goes, where's my song to the mother? Let none of us go without this part of our solutions. Let us leave tokens to our joyfulness from every place. For this is unfortunate, and our lot is this. Let us oppress the poor righteous man. Yeah, that's how, they, that's how the devil, that's how Esau thinks. Let us uh, oppress these poor people. And that's what they do, too. And here it is, poor. You know, you know, poor people. You know, this tax season. Now I do taxes in the last minute. You know how, you know how Jake do. You know, you know how much they tax the poor people, right? Like I'm in the lowest of the lowest income bracket, and they still taxing me 15 percent. Fifteen? My like, God damn! Fifteen? Fifteen? That's what we in the money for right now. Fifteen for look for for the lowest bracket. When you go to a higher bracket, it's 20, 25. I, I, I actually, you know how you used it. I feel sorry for rich people. Y'all gotta pay even more taxes. It's like they get all your money. They get endorsements. Bro, if, if you was a millionaire, they're taking all your tax. You're taking half your money. They get it back though, because, you know, they do all that wicked ass bullshit. That's how they get all these athletes, all these athletes and musicians, bro. They get them for taxes. Oh, they get my, they fucking with my girl Lauren Hill again over them taxes. Again, this year, it's just in the news. Someone else ain't fucking with taxes. Uh, DMX, oh, you know, he, oh, yeah. he smoked his taxes. He, he, sm he smoked came his. out with some new shit. He, you know he ain't paying the taxes. <laughs> he buying the rocks. He, he know he gonna go out with a heart attack. So. Are you hear his new stuff? No, I mean, is it good? Yeah. I, I, I mean, you know, X get it, bro. So. But you know, yeah, yeah. you can feel the brother though, because he, he one of them guys. He got to have that dope. That's that Jake spirit. Yeah. He can't, he, he say, I can't, I can't stop him. I can't, I can't do it. But you know, he believe in the most high, though. Even though he go off, though. He got that one interview, he's a president, like, you can't, can't call no women the devil. I can't talk like X. How do you do it? Hey, yo, can't he's call like, another nigga the devil? Call no man the devil. <laughs> There's no, no one man is the devil. Pretty much saying the white man's not the devil. Right. That's what he's saying. But you know, he going off, bro. But hey, with this truth there, you should be know, X should be known he's an Israelite. Right. Oh, you know, I was watching something, though. I was watching. Turk and the Hot Boys on uh, uh, Breakfast Club. It was a, you know Turk? He got out of prison. He just got out, right? I think it's an old video, though. Turk from the, uh, from the Hot Boys. They was, they was young. Right? Yeah, back in, he got locked up for like 10 years. But, but, but his truth is getting out. He's on these interviews. He was quoting scriptures. That's right, man. You know, I just keep studying to show myself a fool. 
You know what I'm saying? My people was destroyed for a lack of knowledge. I was like, damn, he was, he's in his scriptures. I ain't seen so that. this truth is getting out there. So soon you're going to have a lot of these big time rappers talking about the Israel. Oh, Kendrick Lamar. I mean, they come out and say, they, he said, don't call me a nigga, call me an Israelite. Yeah, even though he would, he off, you know. But, yeah, he off. But they tell you the truth, if you know he is Israelite, he what? can still be talking that shit to Dre. It's so funny because. I've been telling niggas they was like, yeah, now, yeah, now, and he big up there, so he. So now everybody is like, because Kendrick was big to the crowd. Yeah, we've been selling it. It takes somebody famous for somebody to be selling. But that's good, though. That's the most high thing, though. Because he have, you know, famous people going to do the work, too, in secret. Yeah. They come out here, they're going to get mobbed. Remember that basketball player in the middle of Stalin? Oh, yeah. Yep. Oh yeah. And they, yeah, yeah, they, yeah. He got black. He got black. He got black. Shit. He got black. Then the rapper Shine say he is Israelite too or something. Oh, no, something. But he think it is down with the Jews though. Yeah, they, be, they be fucking well, it up. He is a, he is a uh, so-called Jew. Yeah, I mean, he's he a, a Jewish. Yeah, person. yeah, yeah, yeah. Got Olympian powerlifter. Oh yeah. A swimmer. Swimming. Damn. I can Olympians imagine you being a power lifter being in the tree, bro. You see that motherfucker? Yeah. You see that motherfucker, man? Nah. Gotta be. The most likely you power. Amazing. Because whatever you good at, when you get the truth, you get better at it. I don't even care, bro. He's like, I mean, I ain't gonna... The most likely done gave me some talents. You know what I mean? He gives you some skills. I'm telling you, once you, once you get that mind state to study, you show that self a cool mind state, you getting that that study uh that what's the word I'm looking for? That diligent mind state. Man, it's really when the script said with the, the most high, all things are possible. Man, you get this truth, you should be learning all kinds of stuff. You get on a high level. Look at this right here. You know you like that. You wanna rub that belly. You lay down with your head up to her, dreaming, telling her about your psycho. Hey baby, she's working on trying to fix it though. Right? Give us some credit. Yeah, give us some credit. Give us some credit. She was running kind of hard, too. <laughs> you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. What's up, brother? I got a standard in my bitches. That's it right there. The Lord's only dealing with Israel. That's the Lord's chosen people. Just Israel. And that's what we out here for. Just us. That's the only ones that's making it. Everybody else is going into slavery. Just us. Now, how can you tell they're going into slavery? We can get it. because. The Bible doesn't save men that's going into slavery. You read the book of Revelation. Y'all read the book of Revelation. Let's read the Revelation. Then understand every word of it. Okay. Not just read it for fun. Oh, and then y'all so understand what go. life is going on right now. Here you go. That's all I got to say. Can I read the book of Revelation? Y'all have a good day. Yeah, it's like that. I read the Bible every day. Can I read book of Revelation? And then I don't need no frogs. This, this is for the book of Revelation. Well, let's read the book of Revelation. Moses told me not to have no frogs. This is when I go. Are you calling us false prophets? Yeah, that's it. What are you calling us for? Yeah, I'm telling you exactly. Let's get the let's get the words of Jesus Christ. It could be. Let's get the word of Jesus Christ. You don't understand what you're saying. Yes, I do. I understand the Lord. Revelation 13. Sorry, a fool. An old fool. Let's get the word of Jesus Christ. 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 Let's get the word of Jesus he that leadeth into captivity shall go into captivity. He that killeth with the sword must be killed with the sword. And here's the patience and the faith of the saints. Right. He said there ain't no slavery in the Bible. But the Bible said, who leads into captivity shall go into captivity. <laughs> That's why he ran off because he already knew it. Yeah, he already know it. You know what I'm saying? He's all proud. Hey, this is what I'm saying. When we say, okay, let's get it there. And that was it. Let's walk off. It is it is like for your ass. That was funny. You said, uh, <laughs> yeah, he, he's cursed already, so. <laughs> Jake can talk all the same one, but the Most High got you, man. He's got everybody's number. He's got y'all. But, but was it as soon as you said something, you, he called us false prophets? And you said something, and your boy's like, he's like, it is what it is. He's yeah. like, so are you calling us false prophets? He's like, it is what it is. <laughs> Big Elmer Fudd looking at him. <laughs> it's it's rabbit seed. Yeah, it's rabbit seed. Yeah, it's seed. No, it's duck seed. <laughs> <laughs> Oh. Nah, he ain't going nowhere. We good. CC. He just drifting a little bit. <laughs> yeah, it, so that's the thing, though. Uh, what was that scripture you read earlier about how every? Let me get this, man. What's that scripture you read about the Most High's word being pure? Oh, Psalms 12. Okay.
okay, let me get this one. Now. I'm gonna get a different one. Because every word of the Most High is pure, you know what I mean? So when we tell these words, look, the scripture said that heathens are going into slavery. That's what it says. That's pure. That's oh, pure. I got, a, I got a good one. So, I mean, how are you going to say that's wrong? That's not wrong. The one in the city, I said no one wants to be cast with the chains. I know that's what, that's in the song. There's one, of, there's probably one in Ezekiel. Two Noble ones shall be cast with the chains. I, look for it. I know there's one in that song. What was I looking for? I forgot what I was looking for. <laughs> <laughs> this guy was messed up. Uh, the most highest sure. words are clear. That. Sure. That's fine. I done claimed like 20 of them a day. Damn, man, what was we talking about? The most highest words were the Oh, yeah. I'm, I'm, you think I was an ex-boxer or something, bro? Like, that took a, two me to the head. Yeah, yeah. Bro, I, mean, I got the old time, the old time. Uh, he's all over the I know that. I got it, though. I got it. I got it. It's been a minute since I got the scripture. Oh, yes. Yeah, uh, Proverbs 30.